Yo, what's up, ship fam? What is up, YouTube? We're back with another game that Playway SA is involved with. Games Incubator has released the Zoo Simulator Prologue in Steam today. We're going to dive into the world of owning our own zoo and being a zookeeper. Playway SA, one of the publishers, that makes me excited. Look at this. That is so cool. I'm so excited to check out this prologue right here, right now. Anybody that knows me knows I love animals, and so does my wife. This is going to be a cool thing. I bet you she's going to want to play this just as much as I do. Uh, but this prologue, uh, ga Games Incubator says, is just part of the gameplay that awaits the full version. Uh, our main task is to run and manage our own zoo. I'm super excited. Now, I did jump in to make sure that I could use the controller and just like every other game that Games Incubator or Playway SA is involved with, you can. For those of you that like mouse and keyboard, you can do that as well. So I'm going to start a fresh game, and we're going to name our game the Shib Cool Zoo. I don't know why, but that's what we're doing. Um, I'm excited, man. I can't wait. So I think we're just going to run the tutorial. Well, that's a long loading screen. Is it? Maybe. Welcome. This zoo was once popular, once a popular place to visit, provided shelter for many species. Its glory days are behind it, and now it stands empty. You can restore it to its... Oh, can you restore it? Yeah, of course we can. Your relative left you this property to take care of. All right, I don't know anybody that has uh, a zoo, but hey, I'm glad they left it to us. Use the computer. I can do that. Uh, and it says we got to buy a welder. We got to buy uh, bars. Oh, so, okay. So the tutorial tells you everything. The shop, animal adoption. I don't think we have anything yet. Nothing's unlocked except for uh, tools. So we buy the welder. And I bet you our bars are available there. <clears throat> and what does it say? Approach the warehouse. That's not a warehouse. That's a <laughs> that's a garage. That's like a one stall garage. RT to grab the welder. Okay. Grab the bars. All right. Now it says approach the gate with a hole. Wait, I don't have a hole. Oh, no, approach the gate has a hole. Okay. Oh, I can do this. All right, so here we go. I need, I need, I need the bars. Perfect. Now we need the welder. Hey, that's awesome. Check that out. Look at that. That is a bead, man. I, I am a natural born welder, I tell you. Those are dimes, baby. Dimes. Isn't that what welders call it? We got one more to go. Probably turn down the sensitivity. The gate has been repaired. Adopt an animal in the animal adoption tab. Approach the cage. Release the animal. And give it a name. Approach the information board. And check the animal's needs. Right, so what do we have for... Oh, okay, so we got a tab that unlocked. Uh, Rhino. You know what? I do have a soft spot for older animals. Let's give this 39-year-old Rhino. Although that probably seems young for a Rhino, right? What's the life expectancy? Oh, and each one has a different... Has a different cost for shipping. Okay, we're definitely... That one's the cheapest, so we're gonna go with that. Uh, choose the enclosure for the animal you want to adopt. It looks like we only have one available, so let's go with that. All right. Now, uh, approach the cage. Release the animal. 
and give it a name. Come on it. Release the animal. Oh, oh, we, oh, that's right. We got to give it a name. Rhino. You know what? Ricky. Ricky the Rhino. Approach the information board. We should probably close this. Do you think it could get out? All right. So this is what it needs. It likes to play. It's aggressive. And it likes to be sprayed. Approach the faucet. Oh, so we actually... Okay, so we do... That makes sense, though. You're a zookeeper. You gotta make sure they're fed. You gotta make sure they eat. Fill the water bowl. That's... I don't... I don't... I wouldn't consider that a water bowl. That's kind of big. Approach the trough. Oh. We gotta go buy food for it first. Let's see. How much is food? A hundred? Okay. Alright. So we'll buy that. It eats pellets. Doesn't seem like a very good diet, does it? I don't know why the welder keeps defaulting, but it does. So we'll grab the food. Approach the trough. And pour it in. Well, I hope this thing doesn't attack us. But they should be gentle, right? They're like, what are, they're like, uh, they're like unicorns, right? All right, Ricky, we got some food here. We need a triangle. It's dinner time. Jingle, jingle, jingle. Look at that. Now we got to buy a pressure washer. I don't think we're supposed to spray Ricky with a pressure washer. I think that would hurt. Oh, no, we got to clean some dirty stones. Oh, dirty stones. You're a dirty little stone. All right, so how much is this going to cost us? 1200 bucks for a pressure washer. It said, do you want to? Not really, uh, but I don't have a choice. Um, take the pressure washer out of the warehouse. Can we just call it a garage? Approach the dirty stone. Use the pressure washer to clean the enclosure. Show dirty areas. Oh, kind of, hey, kind of like pressure washer simulator. Oh, and look, up top, uh, enclosure cleanliness. Take out the pressure washer from the inventory, aim the cursor. That's the welder. That's not bad. That's quick. I don't know what kind of pressure washer it is, but light work. Making light work out of this. Alright, let's see. Got a little bit right there. Oh, whoa, we got all that. Holy smokes. I sprayed him. Ricky, he, he ran, he doesn't like me. He already doesn't like me. The task said it's done, but, oh, never mind. It was at 99%, so we're finished. All right, so using the slider, uh, open the zoo. Oh, in the computer, so we gotta go back to the computer. And then we gotta wait for our first uh, review. So we're gonna, wait a second, we're gonna open the zoo. And we got one animal. I hope we're not charging a lot of money. All right, so zoo status, open the zoo. Zoo is open. Guests start to arrive, wait for the first review. How do we know, like, we're uh, unavailable in the prologue? Well, it must be another enclosure. Oh, it has little uh, signs of people working. That's kind of cool. So this must be where all the uh, all of our guests, they just walk around this. What is this, like, sidewalk? Gravel? 
I didn't even know this was here. Oh, you can check. You can see the rhino. Hey, Ricky. What's up, buddy? Oh, Ricky's cool, man. Ricky's cool. Look at this. You need a drill driver. Wait, what? For what? Oh, to fix it? So it looks like we got our first review. Check the first guest opinion in the enclosure details window. I don't like this. It feels like we're being graded. Um, Guest opinions. Rhinos have an empty enclosure. They need more decorations. Okay. What does that mean? Go to the enclosure. Place decorations in the enclosure. Okay. Wait a second, though. What do rhinos... What do they... What do they play with? How do we know? Does it say over here? Likes to play. Does it really say? Uh... RB... There we go. So what do we do? Decorations. Did they get a horn scratcher? Okay, we can give him a horn scratcher. What else do we give him? A toy. What does that do? What are they going to do with this? I don't know. Maybe they headbutt it. Check the opinion on the computer. The fact that it keeps defaulting defaulting to the uh, welder is kind of a kind of a bummer. Oh, we got another opinion. They should these are all Karen's. The second enclosure has terrible shelters, and I hope no animal will be forced to live in those conditions. I haven't even opened it yet. Buy a hammer and a shovel. Take the hammer and the shovel from the warehouse. Approach the old hut. Tools. Oh, there it is. And the shovel. Okay. Can we do it? I think so. Now we gotta get it out of the garage. Okay, there's the hammer. Where's the shovel? That's the shovel? That looks like it's a poop shovel. That looks like it's a poop sh a poop scoop. Okay, so here's the other enclosure. Perfect, perfect. Approach the old hut. Okay, while holding the hammer... Ooh, destruction. Hold to destroy... Oh my god, look at me. Okay. I ate my Wheaties today, man. Use the hammer to destroy the decorative wall. Why? That's such a cool decoration. What do you mean? Why do we want to destroy that? What am I, Thor? I think I'm Thor. Now what do I do? Pick up the shovel. Alright, there's something in it. I'm not picking anything up. What do I do? Move the shovel. How do I do that? How do I... I I'm not picking it... Oh, it is filling up, though. Okay. Oh. We got a little more in it. Okay. Oh, we filled the bag. Now what? We got to dump the bag? Yep, throw away the garbage. That is kind of cool. How much of this stuff do we got to clean up, man? I, I think we've got the last of it, right? Wait, where's that thing? Did we already get it? We already got it. Check the opinion on the computer. Wait, what opinion? I haven't done anything. 
The information board by the rhino enclosure looks like it's about to fall off. It holds only... Oh, there's only one bolt. Alright, so what does that mean? I gotta buy a drill driver. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. We want to buy a drill driver. And then get it out of the warehouse. And fix the board. Oh, it's way over there. All right, let's go check this. Oh, we okay. I didn't realize we still had people here. I thought we only like I thought we were closed for business at the end of the day. We still got people chilling, hanging out. Ricky the Rhino is he's our main attraction, man. Uh, fix the position. Okay, so here we go. All right, all right, we got it back into place. Why does it... It defaults to that. It drives me insane. Wait, what am I doing? Oh. Got one. That's what I'm talking about. I am a handy man. All right. That looks like uh that looks like a repaired uh information board if I ever did see one. Now we got to go back to the computer by a tablet. Hope that makes things easier while we're out and about. Look at this lady's still just chilling over here, checking out Ricky. So now it says we have to check the opinions on the tablet instead of the computer. So what is it, this guy? There are too few animals in this zoo. We're just opening. What do you mean? Open the encyclopedia and check the enclosure requirements in the needs tab. Okay. All right, so rhinos, hippopotamus, a gazelle. Wait, 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 didn't that enclosure, hang on, did that new enclosure, didn't it have fruits and vegetables instead of pellets? So we have water, so it's the same water as the rhino. But the food looks different. Yes, it's fruits and vegetables. So whatever we put in here has to eat fruits and vegetables. So let's check out all the needs. Um, not the rhino. Hippopotamus. Gazelle. Ostrich. And elephants. Okay, so let's go see. Can I buy... I can't buy anything. I can't adopt animals from the tablet. Okay. That's all right. We'll just check out the computer. All right. Here we are. So let's go check out Hippopotamus. Can't. There's not available. Gazelle. We got a couple. Ostrich. Ooh. Ooh, I kind of like this. What are the needs for the ostrich? Group size. One to four. So we get like two males. Did they have two males? Yes. Let's do it. Let's go ostrich. We want them in this guy, right? Because that... Ha okay, Ricky's in there. Alright, so there's our ostrich. Release the new zoo resident using... Oh, that's right. That's right. We got to release them and give them a name. Oh, there's not a lot of names that... Start with O. Ostrich. Opie. Opie the ostrich. We're not done. Opie needs a friend. The encyclopedia said we can do two, uh, two males. So we're going to do two males. So the first one is Opie. Onyx? I'm trying to stick with the first letter. All right, so now we got to do fruits and vegetables. 
Wait, I can buy that from here. Yeah, we can use the tablet. Alright, there we go. Um, oh, we gotta buy both, it says. Okay. No, that still didn't take care of it. Oh, we probably gotta fill it. Alright, are these it? Oh, look at these fruit baskets. That's awesome. I don't know which one's which. What is that? That's Opie. Hey, Opie. Where's Onyx? Onyx. Yo, look at Onyx. All right, so we got to feed him. All right, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. Looking good. All right, check the new opinions. Man, people are opinionated, aren't they? Um, let's see. I wanted to use the toilet, but it's disgusting. Okay, so what are we supposed to do now? Turn on the computer or tablet and open renovations category. All right. Toilet. Bye. We did it. Uh, turn on the computer, tablet, go to upgrades. What did it say? Upgrade drill driver. 600 bucks? Come on. Fix the next information boards. Where the heck is that? Oh, up there. Wait, hang on. Hang on. Ostrich needs to They need toys, man. So what do they need? What do they get for toys? Hedge. All right, so we got to put in some hedges. Where are they? Hedge. Yeah, it looks good. Where do we put these, though? I'm going to put one over here. We'll put one over here. There we go. I guess that's it. All right. There. Complain about that, Karen. Complain about that. So we're supposed to go to the jungle hideout enclosure and sell the old decorations. Uh, some old decorations like stand, ramp, potted plants, or old swing are not suitable for animals. Hovering over an object allows to sell it. All right, so where are we? What am I? What am I supposed to? Okay. Sell old decorations. Can I sell this? Okay, so we sold that. We sold that. Okay. Is there more? I don't see any more decorations. Oh, potted. Okay. So apparently there's some more. Because we haven't finished that. I don't see any more, though. Oh. We did it. Jungle expert. Adopt an animal to the new enclosure. Introduce a new animal into the enclosure and give it a name. All right. So wait, wait a second. What animal? I wonder if there's going to be something more in here. Like, is there going to be more options now? I want an elephant, man. That's what I want. All right, let's take a look. Ostrich. Elephant. <gasps> we can do an elephant. What do we want, though? Oh, they're all... Okay, so we got two males and a female. Let's take a look at needs. Like, how many elephants can... Should we do? Up to four. <clears throat> Social behavior. Water requirements. They need a... Ooh, you know what? I'm getting an elephant. We're doing it. We're totally getting an elephant. We're gonna get, yeah, let's get the female. Uh, It's not this one, right? It's not that one. It's that one. Okay. Now we gotta go let it in, right? And we gotta give it a name. It's an elephant. E. I need a female name that starts with an E. 
Edith? Edith the elephant? Edith. There she is. Edith the elephant. There she is. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. What do we need though? You know what? Yeah, let's make sure Edith has plenty to eat. Alright, we got fruits and vegetables. Did I fill the water yet? I did it. So let's make sure Edith has plenty to drink. She also needs a parasol, which I think is what they sleep under, right? So let's go take a look at beds and shelters. There it is. Alright, so where where would we put this? Let's put yeah, let's put this over here. There we go. How does she sleep under that? Let's take a look at our encyclopedia. Toys. What are they? What toys, though? Oh, yeah. We don't have that. We have this. Alright, so we need toys. I don't know what they get. What is this? I don't, I don't know. How would they play with that? That doesn't make any sense to me. We'll put this guy right here, I guess. And we'll, we'll, we'll check the uh, encyclopedia one more time. Toy, toy, parasol. So I guess we need one more toy. What? Skittle? How do I know? We don't know what these are, though. I don't know what a Skittle is, but we're gonna give... We're gonna give Edith a Skittle. There we go. Alright. It says, check the opinion. I wish people would keep their opinions to themselves. I don't know why I keep going to the computer. We just check it here. Um, let's see, there's nothing to eat at this zoo. Well, it's a zoo. As long as we're feeding the animals. Approach the site in front of the entrance. Choose construction site and buy a hot dog booth. Wait a second. Oh. We don't want Ricky the Rhino getting out. Right, so we got to put a hot dog vendor here. Hot dog stand. There we go. Uh, and then we have to get the dispenser from the warehouse. What dispenser? All right, so I'm not sure where this is. Is this it? Grab the food dispenser. Place dispenser in a trough. Wait, what trough? Wait, is this for the animals? I don't know. In the trough. This? Mount. We did it. Do I have- I have pellets, right? There we go. How cool is that auto dispenser? Buy food and fill the dispenser. Well, I guess- I guess I didn't fill it. All right, hopefully this fills it. It should, anyway. Oh, okay. I see it. It's filling. All right. It's still not full. What? I gotta buy another one? How much does this thing take? I found the sprint button. I didn't think I had one. Every time I thought I was hitting the sprint, I'd get down and crawl. But I found it. There we go. So once this is full... That task, or once this is filled, that task should go away, and it didn't. How much does this thing take? Well, we filled it, and we're done. It says, thank you for playing. Be the first to know about updates, exclusive content, and official release date. I don't know when that is. I didn't even look at what quarter it was supposed to be released, but that is super cool. Hey, I'm glad we played this. 
this was awesome and that should be about a half hour uh video so let me know what you think in the comments is this something you'd want to see more of when it comes out when it's uh fully released is it something that you would play i kind of like it i i but then again i like checking out all sorts of simulators but uh that was super cool man i'm super happy that we did this i'm gonna go check out the elephant that's where we're gonna end this video we're gonna go check out with we're gonna go hang out with edith but uh yeah i'm looking forward to uh i'm looking forward to the full release there's edith look at is she playing is that she's playing with the toy anyway as i mentioned let me know in the comments what you think about it but if you're not the commenting type make sure you hit the thumbs up on the video it does a lot of good things it lets me know you like the content want to see more of it, it lets youtube know that you think we're doing a good job and if you haven't hit the sub button make sure you hit the sub button join us on our journey because you never know where that journey's going to bring us next. Speaking of journeys, thank you all for joining me, not just today, but every day. I hope to see you on the next one. Until then, stay safe, look after one another. Be kind to yourself. You deserve it. Much love, everybody. Peace.